Hello everyone, my name is Jumat and today we're going to do a jungle game where I am going to play obviously Talia in Diamond 3. Now I'm against a Shako with a lot of points and they also have a pretty experienced Yasuo and now Tilius. Now on our side we have an experienced Bard. Well, everyone besides Atrox it seems to be extremely experienced, Jesus Christ man. Anyway, uh, I wanted to do two replays, I wanted to watch and uh, comment on two replays, one on jungle and one for mid, which would have sound in a bigger video, but apparently there is a bug going on with the spectator tool, which you can see on Reddit League of Legends, bug post, where you can't write the posts, and everyone complains that there is a bug, and I also had the bug, so I will have to do it live, we're going to do it live, <laughs> I mean, not as I expect myself, well, I have to focus now when I'm playing, but I also talk over it. Now, I'm going to play Tulia this game on jungle, which I haven't done in quite a while, ex ex uh, without counting the last 2-3 games, maybe. I actually played one mid in the past, I guess, but I also played two games as jungle, or something like that. Now, uh, playing jungle is very different, and interesting compared to playing on mid lane. Now, we're going to probably get invaded, so I'm gonna stay right here and I'm ready to go away. Now, you're interested to get the jungle item as fast as you can and if you can fight the enemy, fight him. If you cannot fight the enemy, just farm on the different paths that you can take, such as if you start blue, you can go full clear. If you start red, well, Stay on your side of the jungle, ask for words and ask for help if it's needed. Uh, what are they doing? Anyway, uh, in this matchup I need to focus on getting either... Well, either Atrox or Lux a bit ahead because bot lane... Well, even bot lane, I can, I can do kills on any lane right now because everyone has some tool to stun or CC or whatever the enemy. But I will have to farm a little bit early, I will have to get the jungler item, then maybe the uh, spell pen item from the book. Now, that was a very good bard Q, he missed it, well at least. Thanks for tanking one for that. Well, anyway, I'm going to push as fast as I can, well push, I mean, you know, take these as fast as I can. I'm gonna use, should I use it here? I'm not gonna use it here because it's quite simple to take this without losing a lot of HP. As you can see with the E you actually deal uh, quite quite a lot of damage to these and they die fairly easily. Now there is a slight chance Shaco might be waiting around, so I gotta you know I gotta prep for it. Although I think I can just go for it, because even if he comes, he'll probably use Q to get in range, but he'll probably have no damage to actually murder him instantly, since Shaco now is more of a late game champion than it, than it was before in an early game. Uh, yeah, try to not get it out of that, uh, that TV. Well, wow. And try to not cast a single Q as I did there because that will screw up your whole process of farming. Jesus Christ, I suck at jungling. Yeah, it's pretty obvious that I don't play this often. But yeah, with an E here I will be able to actually kill these wolves too. But I will have to position myself as such. I will catch them all. See, that's excellent. Now, I have a pretty good HP rate. And I'm going straight towards top for help. He didn't flash, that's good. And... <coughs> what? And he's probably going to... yeah. There was no way for me to actually take that before him, so it's fine. Now, I just need... Jesus Lux, really? And that was obvious. Okay, I flashed that one. It's good. She didn't die. Hopefully she will not die there. 
And Shaco is bot now. Shaco is bot now. He has to be. Okay, he is not. But going there actually kind of provided some early defense against Shaco. Maybe he'll still come. Yeah, found him. He's somewhere around there. And probably he's going to gank what now. But I have, have to be around here. Exactly. See this? I'm here. Now, there should be enough time for me to actually... Come on, turn. Come on, turn. Okay, good. That was good. Now, the only thing that is probably... Yeah. Let's dive him. Push, push, push. Go on. Go on. Well, Ezreal? Well, that, that still worked, I suppose, even though I inted there. You can actually kill him. Come on, guys. Oh my god. Never mind. Well, I don't think that's countable as a fail, even though. I should go for the red trinket, sorry, that's a lot of time wasted. And now, where is it? Faster, a bit faster, thank you. Now, right mid lane. Oh my god, guys. Oops, he's out. He's out and I am going to actually... Actually, catch. He's going to escape, will he not? He's gonna catch you, buddy. He's gonna catch you, buddy. Oh my god! That's tilting. That's very, very tilting. Because he had heal up as well. Why did you had heal up? Well, now Shaco got a lot of advantage for no reason. Because my bot lane should have recalled there. And that was an easily abusable gank. And here I am with no mana trying to do something. Well, at least Lux killed that guy. Now, this is my next target. Although, having no mana because I wasted it is not a good thing to know. At this point, if I want to save the game, I. Well, what thing just got killed? Okay, that's great. If I want to save the game, I have to actually uh, just farm till that jungler item and that all. That's all, because I will not be able to actually do much besides that, so... or at least until I have blue buff. Okay, found actually where Shaco is. That's great. And my bot lane is winning 2 versus 3 for some reason exactly after they died. So, that's actually beautiful. Good job, guys. Well, now we won the game because I didn't do well anything besides maybe giving Ezreal some early kill, but... I don't have a reason to actually do anything else than farming right now, especially since Shaco is dead. I could have gone for his... for his... Uh, please don't reset. could have gone for his red, but it's not nearly that necessary. Now, here I expect Yasuo to come, bait him a bit. Okay.
I still go here, but that Shaco gank just destroyed our looks. I should have not ganked, but probably, probably she would have died. Yeah, I inted. Oh well, that sucks. I am a terrible jungler, by the way. You're going to see it now, but still, I have the jungler item now. It's great. I think I could actually kill the ignite. Well, now we have a fed. Yeah, so well, not necessarily fed, but close enough. And a fed. Shaco, how do we turn the game around? Well, we do have now the jungler item and we don't have flash, but we do have some advantage on some lanes, considering some facts. We will probably win. Well, what's happening? We will probably win on uh, top lane and on bot lane. 2 versus 2 on top lane and maybe 3 versus 3 if I'm playing it right. Okay, perfectly calculated. And you're dead. Why did you? Why did you put that there? Let me click. Anyway, doesn't matter. My top laner is actually beating them solo. And there might be a Yasuo coming, but I expect. No, never mind. No Yasuo coming. Okay, I will take just all the plates in the world here because of this beautiful red buff. Now this this is what you should do as a jungler you should you should try to go on these lanes that play cocky go on these lanes that play greedy maybe you get even a vision word from your support and that would be a lot of a lot of useful stuff going on there please do not die okay excellent guys excellent this, this is what i'm talking about here not interested in that one Now, I will have mana for one more gank here, which should be enough to actually finish once and for all their bot lane. Well, actually, I signed it, okay, and here, no, 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 tower, tower. It's okay. It's okay. They don't know I'm here. Uh, well, they misplayed horrendously, but yeah, Lux is doing nothing. Really? Scared of a Kaiser? One for Kaiser? Jesus. Well, I would go for the for the orb there, but Morello is way more uh, Rabdon's way more important in at this scene. Even though they have magic resist, I'd rather have the burst to insta kill Shaco and maybe who knows? Maybe Kaiser too. I'll have to actually defend this now. Ooh. Okay. That went as well as it could. And there might be somewhere a Shiko out his own again. Hey, she just did double kill. Well, that's interesting. <laughs> Okay, finish the tower. I, I don't know what happened on mid lane, but I think she actually won the fair thing because Yasuo was on bot lane. Well, isn't there anything? Jesus. Okay, so there's no reason for Shaco to be here. 
and you're gonna push this instantly into tower because there's no reason for it not to be pushed. There is a vision world. But due to the fact that I want to take this quickly, I will not bother going for it. Now they have an Orn that actually lost lane heavily because that Atrix is a monster. I actually had no reason to gank top and you wouldn't have much reason either if your Atrox is doing well. Because, well, think about it. Even if he dies against Shaco once, maybe twice, he'll still come on top eventually because of the Conqueror thingy. And look at the farm gap. He took the tower solo. He just got himself huge, a huge advantage. In, in that specific matchup, there would have been no reason to actually stay there. And uh, I would expect actually Shaco to camp bot because they have an Altilius and they have squishy targets like Bard and like uh, Ezreal and also on mid lane. Th this is your target. Yasuo can just level 6 and bam. Going towards the mid lane. I actually stopped taking the golems because I maybe would have assisted somehow. What in the name is Ezreal doing? You know, the good thing is that I'm quite strong right now and I can push. Although I can push. Heal, heal, save me, excellent, that's what I'm talking about, there might be a shake over round, but I do have 9 stacks now, as you can see, because I have a pretty good theme, I actually managed to come back in the game even though I died early, and is he dead, um, yes he is, and while we did some mistakes, we still kind of come came on top, because, because if, I'll be honest with you, individual outplays, uh, Atrox winning 1 versus 2, bot lane getting kills on them, but that was partly because I actually gave a kill to Ezreal early on. Well, they did some mistakes too, like getting caught by Shiko after that, but it's not that important because they actually won it after that. Now, looks not following in some scenarios, even after they took some time to, you know. Now, there are mistakes, obviously, that you can see. And there are other things, but overall, I'm happy with how the game goes. Because think about it. Uh, we're just getting free LP here. They picked Orn and Shaco champions that are basically dead. I don't see often, oops, okay, and look, he's not really doing much here either, he just got caught, I actually stood there with the smite ready, even though I did not expect him, you should always do that, that was a nice, that was a very nice, uh, Oh, come on, thank you. Thank you. Now, here is a free blue buff as well. I have 13 stacks. If you're a good Talia player, I encourage you to play her more, more on the jungle role than on the mid lane role because, well, those Dark Harvest stacks that you're going to have regardless. And what is happening here? Okay. So that that got instantly killed. I'm doing a lot of bursts with her here. Also as a Talia, you're going to start to be ahead after you finish those important items. 
because the first one especially because you're going to farm much more easily as I am here as you can see always having a blue buff as well don't pass it because you need it even though your mid laner is probably 5-0 well there it might be useful if you think you're going to carry but it's an open discussion I suppose I'm gonna die here. Okay, I died here. Because I did not go towards that. Oh my god. I knew he was there. He knew I was there, but I didn't. I still failed. Never mind. So yeah, even though you are a bit ahead, you should be careful with those things. I'm going to go for the armor because they are full AD. That's another mistake they did. Even though you are a bit fed and so, you should be careful with the... That bard is monster. Oh my god, I know what's going Oh, you should have used E. You should be careful even when you're 10 0 ahead. That's a nice lux. And is, if you look at this, this guy has the lux tag and this guy has a longer lux tag. But this guy playing Aatrox does probably much more better than someone else who wouldn't be so carry wise oriented. So yeah. Good for me, I suppose. I just missed that. Okay. They are fighting a lot, but. Well, they are winning a lot. I think the game is over. Yeah, I'm kind of disappointed in this game because I wanted to showcase something more. Uh, something more natural, I suppose, but due to the time being and the fact that I don't really have that much time I will just go with this if you want more jungle games than mid lane games please please tell me okay. now I expect around here yeah so I'm going to see him if he comes also because I have this word here it's highly suspected that. Oh look, here he is. Oh my god, really? Ugh. Look at that damage. So annoying. Why am I going here? I'm getting the heal from the red buff, which is great. Whoops. I'm really confused. Oh my god. Really confused about what the Chico is doing. Probably tilting as I did earlier, but still. I don't have mana now, I'm quite useless, but I can hit. I didn't hit that. My mouse went very funny away. Look at that, dude. Okay, just auto attacking, I don't really have much else. Shaker is coming. He was dead before, apparently. Yeah, careful, dude! Yeah, that's not a pretty good shaker, I suppose. Finishing in style, even at 23. Excellent. That's excellent. I really love this game actually. My team is perfect and rarely it rarely happens. Well, that's it for today's game. Thank you for coming to the show and I suppose I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching guys and see you next time. Goodbye.